Minnesota is one of the few Midwestern states where abortion is secure, and that's because of a ruling in 1995 called Doe v. Gomez. In the early 1990s, Jane Doe was a rape victim who was seeking an abortion in Minnesota. She was a low-income mother of two who was on federal medical aid. But under a 1978 state law, the government couldn't fund abortions except under limited circumstances. With five other plaintiffs, Doe challenged the law that prevented medical assistance from covering abortion. They argued that the Minnesota Constitution protects the right to an abortion, and that the state violated Jane Doe's privacy and equal protection under the law as established in Roe v. Wade. Minnesota Supreme Court sided with Doe and ruled that the right to have an abortion and the decision to have an abortion are protected by the state constitution. They stated, in reaching our decision, we have interpreted the Minnesota constitution to afford broader protection than the United States constitution of a woman's fundamental right to reach a private decision on whether to obtain an abortion.